Hey folks, Michael the Hammer Mulligan here. Today we're going to do a fireside chat on Cody lighting the slippers lightfoot. You see, I put out online, put on the internet, put on my Facebook, I said, listen, I need a fight in September at the Jungle Plex. So Cody manned up. He says, yeah, I'll take that fight. So the deal was is if me and Cody fight, the winner of that fight gets the fight, gets to fight the winner of the Josh Deakman Randy Smith fight for the title. So the winner of our fight, Cody and I, get to fight the winner of that fight to be the heavyweight champ for CFX. Beautiful thing. I'm in. I'm all in. I want that title. I don't care who I get to fight to get it. I want it. I don't care. If you told me I had to fight Brock Lesnar, what the hell? Why not? What the hell? I'll do it. So, anyway, Mr. Cody, apparently he's uh, backing off. He says his coaches say that, you know, they got another fight for him, maybe. If you got a shot at a belt, that's why you're here. You're not here to fool around. You're not here to pick and choose and say, oh, that guy makes me a little scared. I don't want to fight him. But I understand, you know. I got Cody on Facebook. I went to his pictures. You know, he does have kind of a feminine side if you take a look at it. You know, he's got a lot of those funny little poses that he does. It makes me kind of queasy getting in the ring with him anyways. But that's okay. I can handle it. I'm not afraid of my feminine side. <laughs> So anyways, listen, Cody, if you're out there, if you're listening, man up, take the fight, or admit it. Say, listen, the fish in that pond are too big for me. I'm going to go over here with people I think I can beat. Okay? That's all I want. Just tell me either way, but don't leave me hanging. You know, Lee Bean, he got left hanging. A couple of others out there warned me ahead of time saying that, well, you can take the fight with Cody, but it probably won't happen. Uh, that's the reputation you got. Uh, and that's fine. You know, I said I'll give him a shot. He seems like a nice little fella. Uh, but apparently not. Apparently you're going to wuss out. You're going to go, you know, eat corn on the cob the long way and, you know, take the easy way out. Whatever you want to do, buddy. But listen, if you don't take the fight, it works for me anyways because now I don't have to fight anybody else. I don't need a warm-up fight in between. I could just go to the winner of those two. So my next fight, instead of you, will be Deakman or Smith, whoever wins. Personally... I think Deakman's going to win. He's a beast. He's an animal. He's a hard guy to fight. And uh, I'm going to have my hands full. He's a very, very hard guy to fight. But I'm not the type of guy to run away from a challenge. Apparently, you are. So, folks, thanks for coming to another Fireside Chat with Michael the Hammer Mulligan.